So, at a recent meeting that I was at, that I was speaking at, during the question and answer time, there was a gentleman who asked, as he was kind of going through the whole job searching process, he'd been through three rounds of interviews, and now he hadn't heard anything. The company just went straight cold on him. And so, he took that to mean that there was something wrong. So, he asked, the question he asked was, hey, can you help me think through what it is that, I, that the company could possibly be doing or maybe what I did wrong? Well, let me just stop that right there. First of all, if you want to become neurotic, that's, that's one way to do it, is to start trying to worry about or trying to think about what other people think in terms of what's happening. You'll never figure it out, and you're not supposed to, right? Their thoughts are their thoughts, yours are yours. But really, more importantly, this smacks of a scarcity type mentality. Uh, you can't. You have to be more like a machine gunist, right? Who has a machine gun that can shoot many bullets all at once and keeps, you know, a bandolero that has it's stocked with bullets so they can keep firing. This person is being more like a sniper. They're being focused and locked in on one person, one job in this case. So if you're in sales, you also get this. You gotta keep the funnel full. You can't just go off of a couple of leads and think that's gonna get you paid for the month. You have to constantly keep that funnel filled with prospects uh, or else you know, your closing ratio is gonna go way down. And so, same thing, if you're out there in the middle of a job transition right now, I will tell you, do not get focused on just this one company because they've invited you in for two or three uh, interviews. Obviously, you want to do your best and you want to show up, you want to be authentic, and you want to be able to articulate what you do well, speaking from a perspective of strengths, of course. But at the end of the day, if it's not there and it's not happening, you got to keep moving. You got to keep moving because there's other companies that do not know or haven't heard of you yet that you haven't had a chance to interview with. So if one thing is kind of going cold, open it up, get other opportunities going. That's going to be the best way to handle that. Well, anyway, I want to keep this short. I'll just say this, as a professional development coach and someone who loves to encourage people and see people uh, flourish, because that's what we're all trying to do, we're all trying to flourish, I'll just end it with this. Here's what you need to know. Always, and I mean always, 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 always work from a position of strength. If it's, dra if it's zapping your strength and making you feel weak, and now you're dwelling on how you feel weak or inadequate, I'm going to tell you your focus is off. So again, always, 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 always work from a position of strengths. Okay, go out there and make it a great day.